Who is it? I don't Hel think I could. I hope it's not on the. My intro! Oh. Hello, everybody. Welcome to. <laughs> it's okay. Welcome to an exciting game of Wavelength. What were we going to say right in the middle? I don't know, but <gasps> would, would it be an intro with me here if I didn't intro with you? Magic. <laughs> What's magic? You're going to get it right in the middle. That was a little much. That was a little spooky. <laughs> oh. oh man! Justin is a witch. Like, what are the? What is are the, Justin a witch or is Mitchell a that's witch? That's so like comically <laughs> funny. Like perfectly right in the fucking middle. Like what are the odds of that? That is wild. Wow. Anyways, <laughs> we're here playing wavelength, and Paul, you are going to be our first person. So we'll hide our. We're playing cooperative, by the way. Well, that makes sense. What makes sense? They're playing cooperative? Yeah. And we're going to try to get a good score. Man, we the could, back of this one. could do like soft or hard. a competition. Where yeah, like I'm good. I'm good. You and I have like different answers. We're going to go with... So it's sustenance and hout cuisine. Oh, I scratched my eye. That was a mistake. I can't believe that happened. That's so wild. <clears throat> All right, sustenance. And that just means like hot food, right? Hot cuisine, hot? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, Paul's thinking. He, he shouldn't just have it right off the bat. I forget that sometimes they need to think in this That's game. Right. Yeah, fuck that bag! <laughs> <laughs> How's everybody out there in Chatland doing? Are you all doing well? What are the rules on my clue? Oh yeah. I can I can make like a single statement, right? I can't be like a this, but Con convey this. a single thought. A Words single like thought. but, while, and when are sometimes okay, but not when they basically combine two clues together. Right. Okay. Don't invent something. Be on topic. Don't use the word on the card or any synonyms. No numbers. Be concise. No modifiers. You prop use proper nouns. Use proper nouns. Don't use proper Don't nouns. Don't use proper nouns. Or was it use? I read it and it did not register in my brain. <laughs> use proper nouns. Use proper nouns. <laughs> okay, all the vegetables that you cut up before you actually make the meal. The detail in this answer or clue is throwing me for a loop. Okay, Justin, here we are breaking bread together. Okay. I'm. We chop all the vegetables. Okay. We prep our food. We prep our food. Like good, proper cooks. Yeah. So what, here's what I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. Like, I think Paul's trying to put us down the middle, right? Because vegetables are food of the earth, right? That's correct. You know, it's not like where they fucking stick a tube down a duck's throat. That's correct. To get, like, the really good duck liver, right? That's and correct. And, like, torture the animal or, like, veal, right? That, that, that's correct. Is that how they get the liver? Yeah, like the what is I don't know it's what. Like, a, well, they they do like to it's like to fat up the the duck or something like that. It's like a horrible French method of that. I forget the name of it though. Ew. But it's, it, like it's specifically not like carrot, you know, yeah. which is like to me sustenance. That's so right. I think Paul is trying to point us a bit more towards the the haute cuisine, if you will. I agree. Because um, like prepping, like can you imagine Paul cooking? First off, yeah. <laughs> Number two, can you imagine Paul prepping his vegetables? He's like madly cutting his carrot when he needs to like throw it in the soup. Oh yeah, you know, is that true or false? Am I painting a bad picture? I can't. It's part do of you the... prep your veggies or do you like do it on the fly? Just oh, I make a soup, but they're full carrots inside the soup. Okay, unprepped, unprepped. unpeeled, nothing. You're onion. serving it when like somebody's getting all broth, and then one person gets four whole carrots. Yeah, <laughs> or just like an onion in the bowl. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, fucking onion. Because, like, to me, cutting your food is not... It's like, you should. You should Absolutely prep all your food. You should. Yes. Yeah. You but I do think that it is a little bit, like, in the way it was worded, I think was a little bit, like, snooty. I you agree. Know? I think it's kind of more, like, in, like, somewhere in this area. Go Land exactly where I think it's going to be. <laughs> yeah. You did it. That's exactly... It was just slightly over the edge. That's exactly where yeah, I Yeah, I'm down. Be. Let's all go right. for it. Done. Wait. Before you lock in, Yeah. I want to talk about this. <laughs> Well, you can see it after we reveal. Fine. Oh, boy. Yeah. 
So where do we go wrong with this? <laughs> yeah, where do we where do we go wrong? So okay, pure so sustenance. so I want you to imagine I like I. I, I do, I do think y'all fucked up on this more than I did, but I get, but I do see why you went down the path you went down. But let me, let me paint a picture for you by showing you my ends of the spectrum. Like, if it had been the very, very end, like, I would have said, like, dog food for, like, for sustenance. Because, like, it's, it, it will sustain you. Right? It's not fucking fancy True. at all. It will give you sustenance. I don't like it, but I agree with it. And then haute cuisine is like those like like shit you get served not on a plate. Frog eggs. And yeah, and it's like something with like gold leaf yeah. and like whatever. Like that's insane. So like the the vegetables that you just like cut up before you make a meal is here to me because well, it's just but why like, didn't you just say vegetables yeah vegetables would have got me there <laughs> yeah no 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 when you were talking I was like I should have said baby carrots yeah <laughs> I should have said oh, fucking love, baby yeah. carrots that yeah. would have been that would have been perfect because I was like it's more than just the gap like, between where dog food is and where this clue is is so small that is also a good point <laughs> no but that, but okay but, but what else what else would you what, what else is between like, well, in, in my mind, dog food's not on there. <laughs> I never would have thought. Of yeah, dog, dog food. food. Yeah, for I me. mean, if you said dog food, I would have went. Sustenance. I only thought of dog food because I was close to sustenance, and yeah. I was like, should I say dog food? But then I was like, no, I feel like nah, dog food. Just like say, right at the just bottom. say potato. Yeah, potato. Yeah, yeah. All right, zero points for the first round. Mitch, you're up. Sorry. I, no, I agree with what you're saying, Paul. I disagree, but I respect your ability. To I was say hoping to get something hair. on the oh, I do the haute cuisine. <laughs> Side of the spectrum, you know. Yeah, but honestly, like the idea of cutting up veggies was like a little bit, a little bit snootier than just a vegetable. So. And that, yeah, the, I was trying to give the impression of like it's not even a meal yet; it's in mm -hmm. the beginning stages, not like not snooty. Or I think that's fair. Like yeah. the idea of sustenance is just something you can just bite into. Yeah, like like ingredients versus like the the meal. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. When I hear cut veggies before cutting, I think of a mirepaw and French food is fancy. Yes, me too as well. That's where my brain went. Oh my god. Like, because it's like sorry. the base I'm of not your. Fucking educated. It's not educated. It's just like. No, but I'm not. <laughs> and I just don't apologize. <laughs> this is a great time. <laughs> this is a good segue. So. I failed high school. Go to my diploma. You doing okay, Mitch? No. I'm not. I was gonna wear a wig today. And a toque. And then if chat was going to be like, what the fuck? Because who was it last time? Was it synthetic or was it dyspaminite? Who did what? Who was like, that's a wig last week. Oh, I don't remember. About my hair. I can't remember. I honestly But then I was going to be like, it's not a fucking wig, you guys. That's really funny. So we got useless invention and useful invention. Let's go with... Are you going to name a real invention or are you going to make one up? Wheelies. What the fuck are... Is that a... It's the shoes of wheels. That's Heelys. Oh, that's what I meant, sorry. Heelys. Yeah, wheelies are when you pop a wheelie. Oh. <laughs> I was like, is it an invention or like a trick? <laughs> Heelys. I think it's on the... Uh, useless side. The useless side. Yes. Yeah, yeah, there's arguments for why they're useful. But do you think Mitch, the most practical yeah. man in the world who doesn't <laughs> even own a Blu-ray player, would think... <laughs> do you own a Blu-ray player? No. Uh, what? What? Me? Yeah. Oh yeah, I have two. I like I own a PlayStation, but like I, you're a movie guy though. I don't mm -hmm. have any movies anymore. Um, like, do you think Mitch is like he sees a kid, <laughs> just like go like this, and he's like, "Thank God the youth of today have that." <laughs> like, just think what they would do if that kid couldn't wheel for like a fucking few. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's now to me. I'm I'm talking to myself that is even more useless. I think it's within one or two notches of where I've just placed it. I'm so I support that. I'm ready to open it up. Okay, let's open no it suspense. Up. Nice. Beautiful Paul. Oh my god, I thought you were gonna punch ball. me, punch me like a straight gun and got really scared. <laughs> you should be fucking scared. I'm coming for you. Points, baby. No, I should have I should have gone like this though. You should have. Yeah. Yeah, perfect clue Mitch. Very, very good. Thank yeah. you. That was a good one. Alright, it's my turn. I love giving clues. Yeah. What are they gonna then croc Heelys? Oh, when, when they fucking or just like slipper Heelys, like you get out of bed with your comfy so slippers squishy. and just fucking you just walking, you're just stepping on a wheel under <laughs> yeah, your under no, your it's soft so shoe. At all. It's horrendous, <laughs> just so painful. It's just the fucking oh, that's so funny. Shows your shoes, bitch. I'm proof they're not Heelys. Right. 
I just I showed up in rollerblades actually. I got mine. So it's scary animal and nice animal, and I'm gonna say hedgehog. Oh, this is a weird one. Yeah. Okay, it's not scary though. But it's scary if you don't know about hedgehogs, and it's like your first hedgehog. hedgehog no, I don't one. think it is, because I think you see the hedgehog, and you're like, cute, and then you're like, ouch. Like, you don't think, you're not scared of it inherently. You're like, aw, and you're like, it's probably soft, even though it's like <laughs> spiky. <laughs> when I, he said hedgehog, not porcupine. Yeah, but like hedgehogs, there's no reason to be scared of it. But like, when I was young, and I saw a hedgehog, and someone probably like had it, and I was like, okay, but I'm wait, a little fearful, because that thing is spiky. It's not scary versus like friendly looking it's nice like it's like personality <laughs> scary or nice like hedgehogs are just kind like what's generous. up and then you like approach a hedgehog and they're just like and they just go in a ball That's like true. a porcupine is like i'm gonna fuck you up i'm gonna bite you i'm gonna scratch you i'm gonna turn around and shake my tail and get you spiked what's the nicest animal like <clears throat> um man <laughs> man <laughs> Probably like a duckling. Oh, yeah, that's very nicest. I thought you were saying scary. <laughs> <laughs> that explains the, my reaction when you said duckling. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what's the scariest then? Um, Duckling's a good one for nice. Like, like imagine like a duckling a, being rude at all. Like a, yeah, right. um, whoa, uh, oh, fish. Anglerfish. Oh, anglerfish. Yeah. An anglerfish. Yeah. So, hedgehog between anglerfish and duckling. I think it's, I think it's, this is the maximum. Maximum nice? Maximum scary. Maximum scary for hedgehog. I think it's here or lower. Man, hedgehog's the weirdest one for this. Wouldn't you just do like... Mm, Listen, mm, you know what I think his thinking is? Listen. Hedgehog's cute as fuck, nice vibes, but they're not... Because they're spiky. Yeah, but you could you do like they're like a little spiky. I feel like you could fill this whole area with just like zoo animals, like donkey. Okay, what's a, yeah? What's our neutral? Let's ground our middle I here. I almost think that's a perfect neutral. It's like a weird mix of like weird, scary to children, or maybe it's just me. <laughs> you know what I think would be? You know what I think would be I neutral? About it. Would be like dolphins. Because dolphins are like cool and fun and they're cute and they can be they can be really nice, but dolphins also can be really shitty. That's true. So like, I feel like a dolphin could be in the middle. Like a hedgehog, a hedgehog isn't gonna. This is like disposition. A hedgehog isn't gonna do something scary to you. It just is wearing a scary outfit. That's true. That just is there. It's yeah. not like doing something scary to you. So okay, where do you think it should be? Well, I don't. You think... want it to be in the middle? No, I don't. Think. I have, to think. I have a lack of opinion on this one. This one's this one honestly scares me. Yeah, I think this one is 25% or lower. Oh, this one's so strange to me. I just feel like I could come up with so many animals in this range, and I hedgehog would not be it. But Tell I me can't think of, of where hedgehog would be. Tell me some of them. And because that might help me mm, see. I'd put like penguin here. Penguin is uh where in in terms of relative to a hedgehog. Scarier or nicer? Because I think penguins are pretty nice. And they're just like, doing. Yeah, I think you're right. Like, I don't even think penguins like bite. Like, I think penguins would be, yeah, like on, in that area, but I think they'd be on the lower end. So you think this? I'll, I'll trust Max. your opinion. I think, I you're think more honestly, on like I lower, but like. Lower nice <clears throat> or lower? Yeah, lower nicer. I mean, they are, as an adult now, no longer fearful of hedgehogs. I agree. Fully. Like, there's children's books about hedgehogs? Like, that's a very... Like, Sonic is a hedgehog? Oh. Like, they're... Like, like hedgehogs are, like, a, a... Like, a... That's true. Like, characterized as nice, I think. They got good... Good brain. Even Sonic, like, his spikes aren't even, like, part of his thing. Like, he never is pointy at anybody. Mm -hmm. He's just fast. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. You fine with this? Yeah. I'm down with that. Oh! 
perfect middle. Your argument makes total sense. <laughs> it really makes argument is what I was thinking. Yeah, yeah. shit, sorry. No, it's sorry. okay, it's okay. Yeah, it's all good. I, did, I just wasn't confident with it. I didn't know where the heck Go that could pull. be. That was such a wild answer. I'm I'm thrown I mean, if I think I, I was thinking, I had Porcupine and Hedgehog, and I said Hedgehog, I think Porcupine would have got you two more. Yeah, 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 Porcupine would have been the, the one. Hedgehogs are arsonists? I, you're right, I forgot about that. It's so scary. <laughs> We're kind of shit in the bed here. Yeah, it's me. I have been the, the factor in both. Yeah, <laughs> the I... newly yeah remix to Taylor Swift. I've been the factor <laughs> <laughs> of <me>. negativity. <laughs> I, I'm the factor. It's me. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, these are both good. There's nothing more heartbreaking in this game though when someone is like getting your clue perfectly and yeah. then another person's like, you know yeah. what? Yeah, <laughs> I actually don't think this is what it is. <laughs> Oh boy, I would love a hedgehog pet. Can I bet they smell too? though. But yeah, do they? We all everything smells. Everything that's a rodent is smelly. <sighs> sure yeah. The children's book. Can you imagine the absence of smell? <laughs> well, given that we need. I was like, I'm pretty sure well. you both can. Yeah, yeah you were describing earlier. Really like most days. Do you ever worry that like something's wrong with you because you can't smell? Yes. <laughs> Did it start for Same. either of you like post pandemic? Is no, it no, 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 okay. no. Always been a thing. Yeah. Do you, do you have any smell right now? Any smell? No. No, me neither. Do you have any smell? Like, am I smelling anything? Like, if I smell me. Yeah, it's a weird way that I'm phrasing that. Do you have it? Like, I can smell I will say, I noticed that this room smelled different when I came back into it after going upstairs to fill up my water. But not, yeah. like... I couldn't tell you what the smell was. Mm. It was just a different just room. Three, I, three well, and I was actually, I was expecting onion and a hot dog smell from it. Oh, I smelled your onion when you were eating it. Yeah. It was intense. Paul, let me know when you're done looking. I'm going to turn on the smell light. <laughs> I think I got to do... <laughs> what is this? Oh my god, it is a smell <laughs> light. That's so, so funny. funny. <laughs> Being nose blind is a thing, you get used to your surrounding smell. You know, Odin? I'm gonna... You having fun, Mitch? <laughs> Soon do Alright, what fun. do we got? We have mature person and immature person. So mature, immature. I'm gonna say Mitchell. You're mature, but you're also, like, going around being like, I poop my diaper! <laughs> he does go around doing that. <laughs> I have Is that him that does that? no oh, idea. I think there are some contexts in which I'm mature and some contexts in which I'm immature. There was and a TikTok. Therefore, I would lean towards. There was a TikTok middle. that was pee pee poo poo humor and it was really funny and I sent it to Julie. And like, I could have sent it to you on TikTok, but I sent it to Julie and said, show this one to Justin. Do you know she said, show it to yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. GameCube one, yeah. Uh, I think that this is a good starting point, right? Okay. Because I think you are a mature person. I think of my friends, if I had to point to who would be the most mature, it would be you. Okay. Right? But you are also... I think this works for a lot of us, that we're all mature people, but we're also, like, fucking not. Yeah. You know? Yes. Just because like, I think this is a fun exercise, can we just, like, go through the... the some names? The, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, some people, sure. and just, like, put them. Sure, sure, yeah, give me a person that we can <laughs> Just do people this. who come to this, like me, Because I, I think Mitch is kind of, like, you. here. Okay. You know? So where would Mike go? I think Mike is... Oh, I, I think Mike's quite mature. In my opinion. Yeah, but I think he's less mature than you. Just on the very nature of your job, you are oh. the most mature out of everyone I know. All right. Yeah. I think Paul is kind of like a little bit more over here, right? I think James <laughs> is kind of like a little bit down over here. I think he's the least... I think, like, I think once again, the baseline of all of us is we're all mature people. Yeah. But, like, James would be what I would consider the least. Yeah. And I think I'm kind of, like, just a bit behind Mike. Like, maybe, like, right over here. Just around, like, the Paul <laughs> area. You just, like, cut out just the pee-pee poo-poo? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my, my pee-pee poo-poo is very strong. Uh, but, yeah, I think Mitch is kind of like... I think you're, like, kind of, like, over here. Oh, man. That's my guess. You know what's so funny? that you, So you're calling me the most... And then, like, earlier today, I was driving the car with Kersey, and I was like, okay, the next song... I'm going to hit next. The next song describes your farts perfectly. Let's and go. What I was it? Next. It made no sense at all. It, it, was, it was something just about, like, like, I want your phone number or something. Yeah. It was... Anyways. But yeah, I, I think that, um, but I think none of us are like, I think none of us are close to this. No. I think we're all on like the immature side. So I think I want to put you kind of like right there. I'm happy with that. Oh. Should have got a bit more. 
<laughs> yeah, we gotta respect the game. We gotta respect <laughs> the game. Respect the game. I got us in the points that one. So. Hell yeah. Alright, Mitch. Good luck. <laughs> I mean, you're also the only one here wearing a collared shirt. Paul's up in a fucking hoodie like a True. pumpkin. I went with food on it. I went to a social event. <laughs> <there>. <laughs> food and cat hair and You had to go to a social event? That's the most mature yes. thing I've heard all weekend. Yeah. And I'm wearing my Costco, thing. like, big fuzzy socks. Oh, I love big fuzzy socks. Over my regular socks. What the fuck? Which, why do you always go, like, look like you're gonna cry? <laughs> Thinking, I guess. Although clothing from Costco probably puts me in the more mature category, actually, because that's like an old person thing. No. To buy your clothes at Costco, no, totally it is. No, you still if you're if you're an old person, you're still going to like a fucking like J C Penney's in a in a mall. Is that what like, J C Penney sells? Is clothing? Yeah, I, don't know. I have no idea. I'm too immature. I'm too busy pooping in my diaper right now, Paul. <laughs> Are you choosing between I, sides still? Or no, I got a side. We're going to do casual versus formal. I don't know the, quite the clue yet, though. I don't know why. I don't know. So I don't know where this whole... I think it actually came from Julie. I feel that she's been a bad influence on the poopy in my diaper. Because that's not <laughs> just like... That's just like in our lingo now. She's been a bad influence on the poopy in my diaper. <laughs> <laughs> Weird way to say your partner's giving you IBS. I'm struggling. It's funny because I've never heard her say poopy in my diapy, first of all. But that's because Julie or is very poopy good. Or poopy or anything. No, Julie is very good at being malleable with the, the people that's around her. Yeah. Right? Like, that's like her superpower. And. Uh, sandals! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, sandals. Like, they're casual, right? Yeah, they're not slippers. Slippers, I would say. Oh, hell yeah. More. Hell yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, slippers. Especially if we're using shoe, like footwear, as our yeah. as our sort of our our line of whatever. Would like barefoot be more? Yeah. Or would that be like here, slippers? We think of like over here for sandals. Yeah, barefoot's so casual. Like so if you casual. put if you're like let me have bare feet, like you put slippers on it, it it, it gives you a yeah. little something. Your feet yeah. are covered, so I'm kind of feeling like around over here, but I'd love to know where you think. I like that. I would personally go a little bit lower, but I'm not mad at this. Right, I think we just do this then and we see what happens. Sure. Yeah, because I haven't been helping. Should have should have listened to you. <laughs> <laughs> so humble. <laughs> <laughs> These games are so much more calm without James. Yeah, I was. I mean, in all fairness, on mission, I got into that fight about yeah, the we... fucking sheep. Was it? The... I don't want to talk about round animal versus sharp <laughs> yeah. animal. There's this post that keeps getting reposted on Reddit of like the roundest bird, and every and it's cute and it's like whatever. But every time it comes up, I'm like, shut up, shut up. I don't want to talk about round animals. <laughs> Oh, for months it's been coming up on Reddit. I'm like, shut. Well, show me. It's probably fucking top right. right now. We got friend and enemy, and I'm gonna say Mike's mom. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So Mike's mom, I I mean I can't. Don't open it. Oh my god! I always fucking do that. I actually did that in one round. Do you remember that? Yeah. It's got to be dead. I mean, what? Well, I know she's nothing not like, about Mike's mom. So. This is a fucking weird one. Can because she, I would say she's, I don't know. I've never met her. No, nothing. But do you know her. any context of like her relationship with Justin? I'm going to guess zero relationship. Maybe they met once. Oh. That's my guess. I think they're on neutral ground. The fact that you don't know tells me that that's probably right. Probably. Because if he, otherwise, if he's not referencing something specifically, although your memory. That's true. Because um, it's certainly not mine. They I might be anything. complete enemies. Yeah, but no, no, no. They're not, they don't have a relationship. So neutral. That's what I would think. But then again. The association with Mike, the fact that it's not a total stranger, uh -huh. pushes it like maybe a centimeter. I agree. That's exactly what I was thinking. It's like, she's, there's no way she's inherently, an like by default, she's closer she's to friends. She's got some friend points. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now let's just think it through. I'm, I'm, I think I'm down with this. Does Mike have two gay dads? Oh. <laughs> like, does Mike's mom not exist? <laughs> Therefore, enemy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, I like this. Okay, let's go with this. Oh! <laughs> so sick! What a great clue! Yeah, that was a great clue. That was a fantastic clue for that one. Hey, you guys did it. It was perfect. Look at that. Good old four. You love to see it. Love it. That means Mitch gets another round. Fantastic. Paul, you're up. 
I can't find this stupid bird now. <laughs> Autobots roll out. <laughs> Sport versus Ooh. game, tastes bad versus tastes good. Okay, hold on, what am I, what am I at here? Is my, are my, is my eye red? This red? This no. eye? No. <laughs> this no, no, it's white, it's white. Oh, thank God. Why, did you scratch it? Yeah, it's so itchy. It I'm feels like swollen out. Tastes bad versus tastes good. Just I'm gonna do. Calm. Yeah. <laughs> so, just fucking calm. And was... we have to like figure this out. We have to do the whole thing. I'm sorry. I really hate you. <laughs> and it's so funny because when you hit me, I was like, it's funny because that like I was expecting like a straight yeah. guy, but then that's what I do. Yeah. I do the gay guy version. <laughs> yeah. Same spot, but I yeah. slap with the tip of my fingers. I feel it. Like I was gonna say come. So are you <laughs> gonna do that? <laughs> well, but no, now, no, now, because we there's no. I know. I wouldn't know. I would have no idea. Because no. like, is is Paul like literally yummy, right? <laughs> Finger licking good. <laughs> Finger. We call it nature's milk. <laughs> Wait, is that like so milk? not what yeah. we call it? And like, <laughs> we're talking about us straight dudes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is that what you say to Julie? Yeah, like she wants to join a nice cold Taste glass of nature's, nature's milk. Nature's milk. Milk. Did did Kirsty show you the gift that she sent to Julie? No. Okay, so Julie sent the video of like the kid drinking milk to Kirsty and you saying like your favorite meal, your favorite drink, and then she sent back this gift that looked like a guy <laughs> sucking a dick, but it was just a glass of milk. <laughs> it was the <laughs> funniest thing. <laughs> All right, we got it tastes good, it tastes bad, and it tastes good. Bad, good. You should watch Homelander <clears throat> drink milk. Oh, man. I like that show. I'm going to say mixed vegetable tempura. Mm, that does sound good. I think it sounds good. He said mixed. With cum. <laughs> Why not just tempura? Is this just another Paul just accidentally adding too much detail, or is there meaning here? You know, it sounds good, but I'm going to be honest. Most tempura I've had in my life has been pretty shitty. Really? Yeah. And I think, like, with the mixed vegetable, you're like, mmm, this piece is good. And then you're like, ooh, what's this? They fucking battered, like, yeah. you know? In my mind, I think the... I think... But I... I it is kind of different than what you're saying, but I think the worst I've ever had has been like neutral. And I think I get a lot that is neutral. <laughs> I think do you, sometimes it's Do you it's think good, it's closer to good neutral. than bad? I think so. Yeah, I, I, honestly, to but, me, what kills you in this game is when you think too much. Uh huh. So I'm kind of like down for it. Okay, but I, the only thing that's throwing me for a loop here is that I'm not entirely sure Paul and I would have the same opinion. I just have a hunch that Paul likes tempura more than I do. Sure. Do you think Paul's like... Before I would up it. Okay, sure. I'm down. Okay. <laughs> Dang it, I should have upped it way more. You, you, I think we're on the right track. In my mind, tempura is like, usually like, like, five out of seven are mm -hmm. really good and then there's two yucky things okay, like, yeah, you know, yeah, no, like, I think that's fair like everyone's fair. got their thing like oh I want the onion or I want the broccoli or yeah. I want the mushroom and I'm like fucking take the mushroom and do not mm -hmm. want the mushroom that's actually the one I was going to use in my example as a bad one yeah yeah. I've also had a lot of mixed tempura lately and it's all been like pretty good and then I, I say no mushrooms please and then I don't get any bad ones that was uh, when Mitch when, he, uh, when we were young and he, he told me his Ito Japan special, which was sukiyaki beef, no vegetables, mushrooms okay. <laughs> That's so funny. Good thing you lost that away. Holy shit, you remember but, that. Yeah, good thing you lost that away. That's so fucking wild. Yeah. That's so wild. Then I grew up and I was like, the veggies are good. <laughs> mushrooms still okay, though. I recently had... How many scoops do you get? Teriyaki sauce. I was like, of tempura? <laughs> Uh, oh, I don't eat it, Edo. Oh, man. I'm sorry. It's okay. So, 
So we got bad pizza topping and good pizza topping. Edmonton's <clears throat> Edmonton's like dine in Chicken. Japanese is like okay for the most part, let alone fast food. Like I just I can't. You used to be able to do some Tokyo Express stuff, but that was mostly like in high school. What did you say? Chicken. Bad pizza toppings, good pizza toppings. Okay, I mean, chicken is interesting. I think it's closer to... I think it's closer... Uh, Mitch? Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Every time I'm with Mitch, you order pizza, it always has chicken on it. So, like, that's, like, throwing things... Here's the thing. Chicken on pizza, generally yummy, but chicken on pizza <clears throat> doesn't feel pizza. It is true. It feels, it feels like, out of place. Yeah, it feels like... It's a flavor. It's not a it's not a type of pizza. It's like a ooh, we made butter chicken pizza or yeah. we made barbecue chicken pizza. Yeah. Like it's like a a theme. It's not a regular. It's yeah. not a standard pizza ingredient. And I, I agree with that completely because like I don't even think of it as a pizza topping, even though it technically is. Yeah, exactly. So it's like. But I don't think it's bad. It I don't think good? it's anywhere near bad. I think like because it's still like every pizza I've had with chicken has been good. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah, I generally like chicken pizza. Chicken yeah. pizzas with chicken on them more than other ones. But I don't like pepperoni or lots of other meats that are usually. I pizza. think it's like in this area. I would go a tiny bit more towards bad, but I'm also happy. But like, but like I said, it. like every time I'm with Mitchell, we order. He orders like we get like a chicken pizza. Do you think it's like he like it's like a top tier topping for him? I think so. I think so. Okay, then I'm I'm cool with that then. All right, let's see. Oh! <laughs> if so it's any close. consolation, I would have pushed us to at least three or two anyways. Okay, so yeah. That's okay. <clears throat> 13 is so close, we did not win. <laughs> have we ever won this game? Yeah, you mean James did. We got like, you mean James, I think, got 20 ish points. Really? Wow. Yeah. Thanks for watching. That's a. Bye.